And we're getting closer and closer to the start of the Spokane Indians game against the Tri-City De Dust Devils. Today is also Creme 2 night at the Indians game, and that is where we're finding all our all-star anchors, Mark, Whitney, Jeremy, and Travis, who are joined by someone you may recognize. So, hey guys, how's it going out there? Hey, good evening to you, Amanda. We're about an hour and 15 minutes away from game time here at Avista Stadium, and we have a very special guest standing here to our left. Very cool. And Ribby, you were going to teach us your famous dance, right? Can you give us a walkthrough real quick? We're all going to get involved here. Oh, Let's see oh. it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Wait, wait. I got to put my Ribby headband on. There you go. That's pretty good. Oh. High five. Oh. Oh. I think Whitney was the best too. Uh, yes. But we do have a kind of a special night. It's Creme 2 night, Amanda, as you mentioned. And as a part of that, there's some special swag giveaways. Yes, for the first 500 kids who come through the gates here, we have this special lunchbox, perfect for going back to school. We've got the Spokane logo here. It's insulated. We've got all the uh, Indians mascots here on the back. So, uh, yeah, come on by. Make sure and say hi to Creme 2. But, again, the first 500 kids who come through will get this free lunchbox. Yeah, Jeremy, it is hot, but it could be worse. We have some cloud cover, a bit of a breeze, so it's not too bad. You know, Mark basically did the entire fork. No, I'm kidding. He didn't do the whole forecast. But hey, uh, last time we saw Ribby, we were down at the Spokane River and it was exceptionally hot that day. Ribby, we were out there cleaning up the environment for your family. You were there as well. Uh, you've been staying cool since then? <laughs> That's a no, ladies yeah, and gentlemen. Kind of a fish out of um, water. Yeah, so Ribby, as you're running those bases tonight, do you have a way that you're going to stay cool? Yes. So <laughs> what Ruby's saying is you can come on down. Yes, it is 99 degrees as we currently sit here over uh, Feltz Field is where we're getting that information. That I can basically see it from here. So it's warm. It's a little bit breezy. Cloud cover is helping. Once game starts, you're in the shade in the stadium. So come on down and enjoy it. Yeah. And Jeremy, this, I know, Travis, rather, this is actually an important game because they are close to being, I guess, on the cusp of playoffs, right? Right. right. The Indians are four games behind right now in the chase for the second spot in the division right now because the Vancouver is at the top. They already won the first half. So the two top teams from the halves get in the playoffs. So real important game for the Indians here and uh, definitely one they could win. They're ahead of Tri-City right now who they're playing tonight in right. the standings. Travis, so. thank you very much. Yeah. We're about 15 minutes away from the gates opening right here to Vista Stadium. Again, game time at 630. I'm told there are still tickets available if you want to walk up last second and come watch the game. But for now, Amanda, and say hi. We'll come say back hi to you. Okay, hold on, hold on, guys. I want to see that dance one more time. Are they still with us? I want to see the dance. Come on, let's see it. You're not going anywhere without it. Here we go. I'm going too early. Yes, yes, that's how it's done, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Well done, well done.